Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Bot. I'm Corey Nockrinder. Today's topic is combo squatting. You might have heard of the term typo squatting. This is when a malicious actor registers a purposely misspelled version of a popular domain. For instance, take Facebook.com. A malicious actor might register favebook with a v.com because the v is close to the c, so it's a common misspelling of Facebook.com. And of course, by registering this purposely misspelled domain name, it might lure victims that accidentally fat finger or incorrectly type facebook.com, thus getting victims to come to the malicious domain name. Now tomorrow, researchers from Georgia Tech and Stony Brook University will release research on another technique that they call combo squatting. This is where malicious actors register domain names that have a trademark in them, a familiar name, but add additional words to that particular mo domain. For instance, it might be facebooksecurity.com or facebookemail.com or some combination of words except that the correctly spelled and well-known trademark is part of the domain name. In any case, this is based on a media story that's talking about the presentation these researchers are going to release tomorrow at a security conference. And what I found interesting about it is according to these researchers, there seems to be far more combo squatting than there is typo squatting. Basically, these researchers started with 500 popular domain names and they restricted it to trademark domain names and came up with 268 trademark domain names that are the top domains that people visit on the internet. Based on the passive and active DNS records for the past six years, they found over 2.7 million combo squatting names associated only with these 268 trademark domain names. That means bad guys are creating a lot of uh, combo squatting, a lot of domain combination names associated with these well-known domain names. By the way, one of the reasons I found this fascinating was because of the recent Equifax hack. You might remember when this hack happened, Equifax set up a site called Equifax Security 2017. Or was it actually Security Equifax 2017? In either case, it was a perfect example of how a combo squatting might work. By registering a domain name that had their own real domain but mixed with other words, they actually made it really easy for attackers to kind of combo squat that domain. In fact, a security researcher actually registered one of those domains, Security Equifax 2017, and in one of their own tweet messages, Equifax actually uh, accidentally referred victims to the fake site, the one the security researcher made, not their own. In any case, I just found the prevalence of combo squatting to be quite fascinating. Uh, this presentation isn't out there, but they plan on releasing it tomorrow. So my first practical takeaway is if you're interested in the research, be sure to check out this study that will come out tomorrow. But more importantly, realize that combo squatting is apparently very prevalent. That means there are a lot of domains out there that might use a domain you trust, like Netflix or Bank of America or WatchGuard and might combine it with other words within the domain name. If you see domains like that, you should remain skeptical. Anyways, interesting research. Be sure to check out any reports that come out tomorrow. That's it for today's news. Thanks for watching.